Hey, I'm Aruf from Building Engineering and Construction. Today I will share with you how to export 3ds Max file with V-Ray texture for Lumion or other rendering like a screen motion or uh, other renderer engine. So let's go. Here is my model with appropriate texture and other things light texture everything here and now I will show you the easiest way to export the 3ds max file to another renderer platform like as Twinmotion or Lumion so you have to install a script like as lime exporter the best way to export your whole scene for Lumion or other render engine with Autodesk FBX format and there are another way so uh, here another one is V-Ray material converter 3 if I show you the material editor then you will see here the everything is in V-Ray bitmap and V-Ray material format here is V-Ray material format but you have to convert it V-Ray to standard material so that's why you need to install this script V-Ray material converter 3 or lime exporter and uh, the lime exporter is paid you have to download it or buy it to use it or you can use it for a several period of time for free so i'm going to do it the first here completing your model and also the scene camera so here you have to go to the lime exporter and missing lime exporter is script so i, I have to load it again so then is scripting the open script or run script the scripting run script here uh, my desired location i have to run it A new folder lime exporter so here the scripting file and i am opening it and here is the option to install it and i am going to install it after successfully install it you have to run it run the script so yes i am going to run the script here uh, my version here my version is paid version so there selected object or whole scene so you have to uh, select any option to so selected object or whole scene i am going to select whole scene and which folder you have to save it so i i am going to save in several folder a specific folder a name that Lumion convert and here selecting folder the you have to put a name so I'm going to put a name name it 3ds max 3ds max to Lumion okay then press ok it is converting the whole scene into Lumion separate file and especially FBX format FBX plugin file export writing FBX file successfully done so you have to press ok and exit the program Now I'm going to open Lumion. Here is the Lumion interface. I am using Lumion version 9. So you have to select plain uh, scene. So I'm going to plain scene or any other scene you have desired. Here is the scene. Now I am going to ex import it. So select the import tab 
and here you uh, where you have where you have saved your previous model uh, you have to go there so i'm going to select the folder and here the folder name lumion convert and here lime exporter 3ds max to lumion fbx format is always in will be in fbx format and here the size 89 megabit so after opening this you have to name model for Lum in lumion and category of which category so i do i do nothing here select ok it will take some time to load the model Here's our model with full texture from 3ds max to lumion and I'm going to position it and exit from the selection and after zooming it it shows the model with full texture what I have done in, in 3ds max and here you can see after going to render option in Lumion you will see everything with full texture here everything with full texture and you can customize it by going to build tab so I'm going to build tab and uh, in materials section I'm going to change uh, these properties and here uh, standard standard and then here setting emissive do emissive format more emissive it is going to make an internal light and face ok and also go to for photo tab and here custom style use night render night so it shows more bright so you have to reduce the emissive level and go to build tab select the material and emissive amount reduce emissive amount and also go to photo tab and here's our scene you can use more light to make it and from this tab if fx add effects to point perspective here camera and go to point perspective and reduce focal length to short the desired photo and after completing it you store the camera and go to render photos and uh, you can also use uh, uh, some effect to make it more realistic